The Civilization of the Renaissance in Italy, is a book written by Swiss historian Jacob Burckhardt, first published in 1860. It is considered a seminal work on the Italian Renaissance, offering an in-depth analysis of the cultural, intellectual, and social developments that characterize this period of European history. Burckhardt's work focuses primarily on the Italian city-states of the 14th to 16th centuries, particularly Florence, Rome, and Venice. He explores various aspects of Renaissance life, including art, literature, politics, religion, and social structures. The book highlights the revival of classical antiquity as a defining feature of the Renaissance. Burckhardt argues that during this period, there was a rediscovery and reappreciation of the cultural and intellectual achievements of ancient Greece and Rome. This revival of classical ideals influenced various facets of Renaissance society, including the arts, education, and political philosophy. Burckhardt examines the role of prominent individuals in shaping the Renaissance, such as artists like Leonardo da Vinci and Michelangelo, as well as influential thinkers and writers like Machiavelli and Petrarch. He explores their contributions and the broader cultural context in which they emerged. The civilization of the Renaissance in Italy also delves into the political and social structures of Italian city-states. Burckhardt discusses the rise of the merchant class and the emergence of powerful families, the patronage of the arts, and the interplay between republicanism and authoritarian rule. The book offers a nuanced view of the Renaissance, acknowledging both its achievements and its contradictions. Burckhardt explores the tensions between the humanistic ideals of the period and the darker aspects, such as political intrigue, social inequality, and religious conflicts. The Civilization of the Renaissance in Italy is regarded as a classic work on the subject, providing a comprehensive and influential analysis of the Italian Renaissance. It has had a lasting impact on Renaissance studies and continues to be an important reference for scholars interested in this transformative period of European history.